let's talk about abs. Um, abs are always a very interesting topic for most people for some reason. And I think the reason, the real reason, is because your core is the foundation of your overall strength. Your core holds all your body together, and most strength moves initiate from the core. And I think this is why, like, if you look at, for example, statues, classic statues, Greek and Roman statues of heroes, like Hercules, for example, which were inspired by the athletes of the time, you notice really big cores, like really thick abs and obliques. But very often, abs and core are trained inadequately. And I feel this is because of different reasons. First of all, in order for your abs to show, you need a very low body fat, um, which is attained through intense cardiovascular exercise and the correct dieting. And I feel like most people who don't have this sort of definition tend to forget about abs because simply you can't see them. Also, there's a very wrong perception that if you just do like a thousand crunches, you're burning fat on your abs. This is not how it works. As I said, you need cardiovascular exercise to burn fat overall in your body. You can't just train a body part thinking that you're gonna burn fat in that area. So once you attain the definition you need, it's very important to add thickness to the abs in order for them to really pop out, really stand out. And in order to do this, you need to dedicate the, to the abs the attention they deserve. So your core is a huge muscle if you think about it. So you can't do a few crunches or a few abs exercises at the end of, the, of your workout, just before you go home, or you know, if you have 20 minutes to spare. It's really a workout on its own. So for me, I dedicate a whole workout session. So like the same way I do back or legs or chest, I dedicate a whole workout session to abs. In order to do this, you need to know the basics of the core and abs workout. The, one of the simplest exercises is obviously the crunches. I like to perform this by raising my legs, keeping them straight and crunching up, bringing my knees in. In general with abs it's good to go until you really feel the burn, until failure, and then take short breaks and carry on. Um, another very good exercise which I find is a basic for your core strength is the cable twists and any kind of twisting movement you can do it with uh, a heavy bending symbol and do really dynamic moves you can also include other exercises for example leg raises is another basic exercise you can do it from hanging or lying down or on a bench or from the exercise ball I provide a few of these examples in the exercise anatomy series. So really focus on this exercise, really go until failure with abs. You need to do a lot of sets, really feel the burn and shorten the rest time.